I use the chalk dust in the color C. The reason I use the chalk dust in the color C is because I have a pinkish yellowish undertone so it really fit my skin. I can use chalk dust for setting under my eyes, um, setting all over my face, and I really like it because it gives me a nice smooth finish with no flashback. I use the letter R in chalk dust. I use the letter R in chalk dust on my skin tone because it has a neutral undertone and I'm pretty light. You can use chalk dust to set, bake, or highlight your face. The letter chalk dust I use is the letter A. I use this letter chalk dust on my skin because it has neutral tan undertones. You can use chalk dust for various reasons. I like to use it before applying my foundation so I don't have any oil breakthrough. I use the letter Y in chalk dust. I use the letter Y in chalk dust because it caters to my beautiful chocolate skin and it doesn't make me look too yellow. I can use chalk dust from preventing my concealer from falling off my face and setting under my eyes and my smile lines. I use the letter O in chalk dust. I use the letter O in chalk dust because it sets very well with my NC45 concealer and it gives me a nasty glow. I use chalk dust for covering my eyebrows because I don't use them, period. And they also sets under my eyes very, very smooth and silky. I use the letter N in chalk dust. I use the letter N because it doesn't give me any flashbacks. I can use chalk dust to set my oily nose and to carve out my contour. I use the letter S in chalk dust. I use the color S in chalk dust because I'm fair skin and it's really versatile. As an SFX artist, I really like to use chalk dust to set my white, um, especially the letter S because it doesn't have like any pink or yellow undertones to it and it's just like a sheer white and it really mattifies and locks in my paint.